Hey guys, I'm back and I'm finishing off packing for Joss for Spain. I've done some things and I was about to do some glasses and little accessories. So I'm going to be using a dance bag here and putting in glasses first. So I've got some reading glasses, like TV glasses, like what me. I need glasses to watch TV, not look at things far away. Some blue sunglasses, because blue is one of my favourite colours. And some yellow sunglasses. And that's just for like, going down to the beach, and things that you just might need. Next, I'm going to be putting in, since I didn't get to finish off everything, I'm just going to be putting in a flannel. And it's a purple one. And I probably won't be able to fit the last item in that I needed to fit in. So I'm going to try and fit in a camera. My yellow, uh, well her, yellow camera. I'm filming this on my iPad, but I'm going to be filming it on my phone, or on the phone. My dad's phone. So the entire trip that Alex is coming up soon. So that all fits in there. It's kind of lumpy, but it fits. And that's what that's that. Next I'm going to be doing her handbag. So she's going to be in her handbag. She's going to have the little writing book. So it's got things like um, chair news, video contest ideas, her schedule, a little poster. And then I've done like what I know I got her, and, like a, li a little passport. And then I've got like some math sums. So I'm going to put that in. Next I'm putting in some money. She's got three dollars here. And Joss Kendrick does come with a phone and, and a card. And with I've got the phone here. But what, when I take when I want to change the screen, I actually put my card in there because once I almost lost the card. So if I put the card in there and I close it up, then it all fits nicely. So I'm putting her phone in the front here so it looks like that. You probably can't see it, I've got her phone, her book and some money. So that I've just put in her in her little handbag so she's got it. Next I want to do like start on, I've got a few big essentials here but that can go in another bag so i'm going to start off here in a kind of big suitcase this is a new york doll collection suitcase i've not got one but i get suitcases and things online so i'm going to be starting off with some shorts and some pajamas and then like some bottom hats so not no skirts i'm coming to that later so, so I've got, I'm going to start off with some shorts. So I've got these nice shorts that I really like this colour. It's like a coral colour and they're our generation and they're really stretchy. And next I've got these shorts and I love these. And one of my favourite things about these shorts is that they're quite spotty and they go with quite a few things. And then this is actually Joss. This is Kama Joss. This is actually this outfit when you get the doll, you get these shorts. And you've got little patterns at the side. And I really like it. And I love how it looks like you've actually got buttons down the side. But it's just Velcro. I have to put my foot on them because they all pop out. Next, it does get quite cold in Spain sometimes. Especially at night. So I'm giving her some jeggings. So like half leggings, half jeggings. Half leggings, half jeans even. And I've got these little, these are just good for the beach because they're very thin material. And if you were out here, or if you got these and you felt how thin they were, you know what I mean by thin. But they're like really thin and like she, she will still get tanned. Next I'm going to be putting in these leggings. These are like crop leggings. And they're good. I've got a little like dressy top that goes with them. And then I've just got pyjama bottoms, so I've got some stripy ones and some white pyjama bottoms. So I'm just fitting all of those, they all luckily fit. And I'm 
just, I think I'm just going to put in like a bow and I think that's all I can fit. I have got a hat that will be going with you soon. Next I'm going to be doing a small bag, so like for some little essentials and it's quite small like I said. So I'm just putting in like her travel diary in this little pocket and I'm just putting in like a towel in there, a hat in there. And I'm just going to put in like a tray. I do want to take some little of these, but um, I'll have to see if they fit. I'm going to I'm going to try and see if this. What I want to put in will fit. I'm going to try and start to put in some shoes. So like I've got some pink fluffy slippers, and these are really nice. They're out of the ocean, and they went with the pink. Oops, I'm going to try this one. I'm going to try and put in a pig. This is a stuffed pig, but it's not a real pig, but there. You might have thought for a second, how can she fit a pig in there? So that's done, and she's, these are just some of the places that she's been to. So she's been to the Great Wall of China, Paris, London. Yeah, that's all the places she's been to, but she has been to like America and then. So next I want to put in this little, this is my school bag. And, but I'm going to use it today. So I'm going to try and put some shoes in and maybe some pants. So I've got these pink sparkly shoes and I've also got some ones that look a little bit similar but they're black. So you can fit in like two or three pairs. So I'm just putting in my second black pair. That's what they look like. I've, I always squish them together because they fit a lot more easily. And I can't fit anything in the front pocket because that's like where your pencils and your erasers go. And I don't think they would squash up that small. So I've still got one pair of shoes left to go. And I've got another, I've got two more pair of shoes that I've already put into this little bag. I've got to put some flip flops and some like high shoes. So I think I'm going to be able to put the shoes in that I wanted to. I've got a little bag that I'm probably going to put the pants in. So that's what the bag looks like. So I'm going to use a little bag. This is like another handbag. I guess it's good for like shopping. So I'm going to put some pants in there. So I've got three pairs of pants. And she's wearing some. So I've got these stripy ones. That's purple around the edges. Some pink ones that my friend Frankie got me. And then these are actually um, one of my other dolls, Harper's pants. And we're using those today. So they all fit in here very nicely. And I'm going to put in the cookies because I've just got room. So it makes sense if you've got room for them to do it. Next, I want to use, um, probably won't be able to get everything in here, so I might need to get some more bags. But I'm going to, okay, this is a big bag. So I can fit quite a lot of stuff in this bag. So I think I'm going to start off with like the tops because these are very important. So I'm going to start off with the pyjama tops first. I've got these, uh, the piggy top that goes with them. And I've got another, the star top. This is, these are pyjama tops. So I fold them into quite small pieces. And I'm going to fold them and put them in the corners. There are quite a few, your parents might fold, you might fold your clothes differently to me. That's your option of how you fold your clothes. I've actually got a robe, that's a Hogwarts robe, but a magic school robe. And I just want to use that to, because in the morning it is really chilly. And trust me, most of the time I'm the first person that can, in our room. So this is like a little jacket. So it's just good to put on top of something if it's just a little bit chilly or if you're going climbing or something. I've got a cardigan because if you, it, it might not be that cold and our villa gets quite cold so if, or if we have a barbecue or something. So I'm just going to give her this little dog top and she is bringing her dog with her. Next she's got this little top and I love this top. It's this good top for school or being at home and it's just so cute and I love it. 
She's got this top here. This actually goes with the jeggings, but you and the little star jacket. But it can go with other stuff. It's a long sleeve top. That's also good if you're going climbing in the mountains or something, or if you go climbing where it's quite chilly. I've got a little summer's top here, and this is a really adorable top because it's got a little heart in the corner of the top about here. So it's really nice. Next, I'm going to put in a long sleeve top for if it because it does get quite cold. And since it's very since we're going to um, on holiday to Spain, we're really close to Halloween. Luckily, we get back just before October. I've put a sun seed, a sun top in there. It's good for the beach. And then, then now I'm just going to put in a stuff like a stripy top. She's got this little crop top that I did say, not crop top, but like a top in your sleeves or sleeveless top. And I did say that this I've bring some beach leg trousers, so this will go very well with them. I've got this one. I love this top. I found it so adorable, and it's so cute. My and this is a comment to my friend Frankie. Thank you very much for getting this for Harper. But it fits better on Joss because his Harper is really baggy. And for Joss it just fits very well. As you can see, it's very fluffy. <laughs> now let's get to just fold this and get to the next bit. This is like very good for parties and it even goes with some shorts just for the day. Next I'm going to try and do the skirts. So I've got this like skirt here it's really cute because it's like all stripy and it's got checks on it this is a good